This exercise will explore some additional tools for plotting downhole point and interval based data. Click on the strip logs two dimensional single log option. Click on the 2D strip log designer tab. Turn off everything except for the title, depths, and P data number one options. Let's have a closer look at some of the P data curve options. If you select the fill gradational, you should get a strip log that looks like this. Notice how the colors range from the low being yellow to the high being red. These end member colors can be changed to anything that you like. Try changing these colors. Press the process button and see what happens. Now, select the fill style only fill portion above cutoff option and set the cutoff level to 25. Click the process button and you should see a log in which only the gamma values above 25 counts per second are shaded. We encourage you to spend some time experimenting with the various data plotting options to see what's available. One last tip. You can save multiple log layouts by clicking on the special menu options within the upper left corner of the menu, clicking on the Save to RCL or Rockware command language, and specifying a name for your settings such as Gamma Resistivity Layout Number 1. In this way, you can build a library of log formats that suit different applications.